So I'm at the Yamaha dealer this morning because two days ago when they did the oil change, uh, they must not have put in enough oil because the low oil light doesn't flicker. It comes on and stays on. First time for two seconds, second time for two minutes. Riding it gentle today again. Oh, look at that oil light again. That's the one thing you got to keep right in order to keep the warranty valid. So took it straight to him. I was nice to him. I didn't cuss him out. It stresses me the hell out because if, you know, if I can't trust a dealership to put in the right amount of oil, fuck. <laughs> what can you trust? It's very simple. It's not like a phantom range adjustment. It's like, put in this many ounces. Pretty simple process. Somehow today it wasn't simple. And yesterday it wasn't simple. And I got the book, and I, I had to wait because, you know, two days ago I didn't have it. Yesterday I got it. I got it late after they were closed. So I went and I looked at it just to verify, yes, I'm looking at it right. And as soon as I look at it, it's like, holy shit, that is on the absolute lowest line possible. I would never do it that way. I'd put it halfway. Because if you put it halfway, you're good. You lose a little bit, you've got some left. But if you put it on the minimum, and there's anything, you know, leakage, whatever. Now you're below minimum. Now you have a problem. So we're we're gonna see. It's back there in the service department. I'll get looked at and we'll see how that turns out. Hopefully this will not be a poor conversation. Kinda like this place. You know, I like the line, I like the bike. But holy sweet Jesus, Batman. When you're talking a twenty thousand mile ride in the summer, you gotta have a well right. I mean I told him brakes belt, cables, oil, and those are the things that have caused me trouble. Talk to you later. with the cost I saw looking at some of the service fees Yamaha was looking for and I was like well I've been trained two years at uh, MMI I might as well put that into play so I went and priced the uh, book at the dealer that was an unfortunate price point uh, they're really, really looking to seriously price gouge but I would say rape would be closer to the term and it's a uh, complete gang rape so I went online you can find a lot of shit online. This is what I found. $42 with shipping. Hmm. And that's fortunate, because after they did the last service, <laughs> oil level light came on. If I'm going to pay you to do the service as a trained Yamaha tech, there's a thing that I expect not to happen after service it gets done on my machine. Uh, that thing would be any kind of warning lights as a direct result of the work you supposedly did to factory spec during service. So now we're gonna inspect this shit and we're gonna see what the fuck is going on. <laughs> 